हेलो थैंक यू फॉर ट्यूनिंग इन टू बट्टा फास्ट ये एपिसोड काफ़ी लंबी थी तो इसलिए हमने इसको दो पार्ट्स में कर दिए हैं ऑन यूट्यूब यू कैन क्लिक हेयर टू वॉच द सेकेंड पार्ट एंड ऑन योर पॉडकास्ट इफ यू लिसन ऑन ऑडियो जस्ट मेक श्योर दैट यू फाइंड द सेकेंड एपिसोड एंड लिसन टू इट थैंक यू हेलो और वेलकम टू वॉट विल डेफिनेटली बी माई फेवरेट बट्टा फास्ट एपिसोड वी आर विद रॉयल्टी ऑफ द पी एस एल the first three time winning former pakistan world cup managing new logo to pakistan way providing my can we friend. call him supremo can we call him supremo supremo who's that supremo or swengali supremo formerly working with chimo but cricket whisperer <laughs> cricket whisperer psl whisperer but the 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 yeah the creator of legends uh and a man who helped messi win the world cup with my help of course of course uh, and yeah a great friend of both of ours or uk in the rehan bds se padha hua hai to isliye maine english mein kiya taaki usse samajh aaye urdu obviously you know <laughs> bds walon ki it ki weak hoti hai uh, to you know rehan learned urdu ready to be part of the cricket world um so so that's also right. punjabi punjabi oh ah, there exactly he exactly. didn't need to learn urdu he's got punjab punjabi you know so you can communicate with the players at least yeah yeah and so, just on the, just on the messy thing i would like to point something out here so maine trophy ka picture lagayi when i'm like right dying right next to the trophy or kisne likha sasta china ka messi or i was right go <laughs> Every third person literally said that to me. Acha, so Rehan, boy, Messi, but not all the hands. I said, Oh yeah. <laughs> like, I was like, I mean, that's what you do with a trophy. So I like Messi. Yeah. I mean, that's been going on for like fifty years. But okay, man. <laughs> oh, by the way, but like the final, ke baad mujhe jinx se itna dar lag raha tha aur football ka wo tha ke basically, I'm sure uh, Rehan will deny this. So allegedly, uh, this uh, highlighter near. Imad's mouth allegedly was a cigarette, and then some took a thundo. Did it? So, was his condensed air bahar nikli dhuwe ke form me. So, wo jab hua, to kisi ne fir tasveer bheji. Ye galat samajh ke ki wo cigarette pi raha hai. Johan Cruyff ki uh, in the half time the World Cup uh, final smoking a cigarette. Me foreign group me dalne laga. Boy, se Imad ka level dekho kya ho gaya. Cruyff se compare kar le. But then I was like, fuck. Half time, Cruyff lost that final. So I was like, shit, shit, bad juju, bad juju. So benefit they got. The ACSU like Rehan can't read our messages during the game. Uh, just, just so that it's clear. But I just first, didn't want to put it out there. The, the first reply that I got to that uh, to that that picture was so uninspiring, man. So I at least Johan Cruyff got as a comparison. The first reply I got was Ben Stokes smoke. In the innings break in the World Cup final 2019, also I was like, "Yar, ab ye yane ab Ben Stokes ko compare kare hai maad." Ben Stokes ne jaake kisi organic farmer se jisse usne dosti banayi aur phir jo uski beetiyon ko school se dalwaya uska bana wa joint bhi raha tha. You know, like there'll be some big story ke it's actually this was helping him the farmer and that's why Ben Stokes ko pasand bhi nahi hai aur wo heal bhi nahi kar raha tha. But usne kaha yaar. Wait, acha ek thing. A ek that's the Mamba United story though ke. <laughs> देखो एक एक हाइपोथेटिकल सवाल है अगर फर्ज करते हैं अगर इमाद वसीम वाकई में सिगरेट पी रहा था जो कि नहीं पी रहा था और सिगरेट पीना बहुत बुरी बात है यानी किसी को नहीं सिगरेट पीना चाहिए बच्चे सब छोड़ दें अगर इमाद वसीम सिगरेट पी रहा था तो कौन सा ब्रांड पीता हो पीता हो इमाद का जो लेवल है वो कौन सा ब्रांड पीता फिर bro come on yaar hypothetical yaar come on the, i i will i will answer on behalf of rehan and then we'll start this proper instead of like acha uh... ek second ek second now i realize why i avoid doing podcast with you guys dekho pehli baat uswan jo galti aapne ki hai na ke brand puchne se imply ye ho raha hai ke ye secret normal thi aur bhari bhi thi theek hai so from maybe brand interpretation ki se रोलिंग पेपर का ब्रांड क्या है बट यू नो यू सेड दैट दिस वाज द प्राउडेस्ट अचीवमेंट ऑफ योर करियर तो हम यहीं से बट लाइक आई विल स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हेयर आई हैव अ लॉट ऑफ क्वेश्चंस वेल बट आई थिंक 
we'll bring that up later. Um, शुरू करते हैं कि तुमने ग्रुप में कहा था कि विनिंग दिस वाज़ द प्राउडेस्ट प्रोफेशनल अचीवमेंट ऑफ़ योर करियर अब यू समबडी हुज एज आई सेड वर्ल्ड कप में मैनेजर रह चुके हो तुम यू नो यू राइटिंग यू वर्क विद लाइक ऑल दीज लाइक इंपॉर्टेंट जर्नलिस्ट ग्रेट वेबसाइट्स यू कम ऑन टीवी यू यू नो एंड यू वन टू मोर पी एस एल्स तो ये वाली स्पेशल आई थिंक जो पहली दो पी एस एल थी आई थिंक वन वी वर गोइंग इन टू द टूर्नामेंट सीजन वन के अंदर तो आई रिमेंबर देर सम पीसेज ऑन यू नो हाउ गुड इस्लाम आबाद लुक्स ऑन पेपर एंड वी डि नॉट हैव अ ग्रेट स्टार्ट आई थिंक वी वन ओनली टू ऑफ द फर्स्ट सिक्स गेम्स देन यू एंट ऑन रन बट देर वॉज दिस फीलिंग एट दैट टाइम इन द ड्रेसिंग रूम एज वेल के यू नो पहला सीजन है हो गया ठीक है ऑल्सो इट वॉज ओनली अवेंटीन एटीन डेज सीजन एंड आई हैव जीरो मेमरीज ऑफ दैट सो आई कॉन्ट रियली बिकॉज एट द टाइम इट वॉज सो मच गोइंग ऑन एंड कैप्स नहीं थे मैचेस के दौरान में Yeah. So I still remember I remember uh, you were with me the night we won the final and I was booking flights instead yeah. of celebrating. So I mean obviously when you're booking flights after winning the final it's not as sweet right? So <laughs> And then and then PSL 3 I think was built on how what we did in PSL 1 and 2 and um, basically it was a set, settled team um we got good draft picks that year as well and um to go into the draft having second pick in every round or hame ronki fahim all these players we got in the draft and then you know we already had shadab and winning that was also part of the like the first year legacy was continuing there but you know misba was captain still leading but psl 3 ke baad misba basically we all knew we thought that he end his career he still went on to play another season with peshawar zalmi but we we thought that this, this was his last season at the time and um we had to rebuild the franchise so psl4 me mohammad sami became captain 5 me we made the decision to make shadab captain now that's the interesting bit here because dino had left misbah had left uh, most of the senior guys from the first you know 3 4 seasons left the guys who basically were the leaders of the dressing room and then this young kid who was emerging player was made captain and we finished bottom of the table that season the only time we've not played a playoff and i remember you know even shadab after the tournament finished said k r you know i'm sorry maybe you shouldn't have made me captain and all of that so i mean to tell him back then ke you know believe in yourself we all trust you the franchise trust you and this is a process and we'll back you and then you know the journey that it's been ke psl 6 mein we were by far the most dominant team lost two playoff games 7 mein i mean we needed something like seven of the last seven balls against lahore to reach the final we couldn't do it Eight May we were near fifty two of some like forty two balls with seven wickets in hand couldn't do it against Zalmi, and all this thing was that our misba tha, Dino tha. That's why they won the trophies, and uh, you know, uske baad unhone kuch nahi kiya. Although I do have data and stats to say otherwise, but they. <laughs> but like at no point in this like was there any time where we said the process is not right, and I mean. We're a very process-driven team, and most of it is comes from the captain as well. Because he also believes in this season that believe process first, process first. In fact, in this PSL, it was a mess. It was a hurdle. In the middle, by the time final, in the middle, he was giving his speech. So he said, "Guys," uh, and before he could say the next thing, everyone said, "Follow the process." <laughs> so I, I mean, the, the, it was so sweet because what we did heading into the draft, the Nasim trade, the Imar trade. uh and then you know the way it worked out and the proudest moment for me was ke there was islamabad united ka koi player top 5 wicket takers mein nahi tha islamabad united ka koi player top 5 run scorers mein nahi tha and yet we won the trophy and yet there were every single person in that team contributed at some point and some very crucial you know uh contributions for example jordan cox for example people think did not have a great tournament but contribution ki jahan tak baat hai final mein he saves the boundary Yeah. Uh, which is yeah. a certain four, and he yeah. saves a boundary and saves three runs, two runs or three runs, and at the end we win on the last ball. And there's a four that Fahim saves in the second last over or the last over. Yeah. He's yeah. at power and he that's a great save that could have gone for four. So I mean, at different points, different people stepped up, and the idea behind this team has always been some of it, some of its parts rather than over dependence on anyone, and that's what makes me the proudest. K, we did it our way. We did it. the way that we wanted to like peshawar zalmi wale match mein everyone said oh you know ne pehle batting kyun nahi ki chase kyun kiya pichla match mein batting first jeete but we did it our way and we did it our way in a in a way which is the most islamabad united way ke aapke char panch out ho gaye hain at no point are you behind the required run rate 
एंड हैदर कम्स इन एंड हैज टाइम लाइक उसको पहली बॉल से मारना नहीं पड़ा बिकॉज मार्टिन गप्टिल ने जो बाईस रन का ओवर लगा दिया था साइम को उसके वजह से भी वेर हेड ऑफ द गेम सो एट नो पॉइंट द न्यू बैटर कमिंग इन हैड टू टेक चार्ज फ्रॉम बॉल वन एंड दैट वॉज द आइडिया बिहाइंड बिल्डिंग दिस टीम एंड ऑब्वियसली यू नो माइक हैसन प्लेड अ ह्यूज रोल इन इट कीपिंग एवरी वन काम इन द ड्रेसिंग रूम एंड वन ऑफ द कामस्ट पीपल आई आई वर्क विद प्रोबेबली द कामस्ट इन टर्म्स ऑफ द फैक्ट के I think of myself as very calm in the dressing room until the last moment jahan pe main thoda over celebrate kar jata hu ya thoda over emotional rehta hu but during the game mere flow quite quite similar hoti hai and he is like 10 times calmer than i am around the players and uh, it was so refreshing to see wo dekhne ko milta hai dugout pe jab they cut to it na to yeah. i remember like after a catch drop so hessen's face was still inscrutable or maybe because i know you as well but yours it is gone to like like <laughs> how consistent the messaging is obviously between you guys and between the team because shadab has been saying almost exactly the same things that rehan is talking about now about the process about not letting any doubt in into you know believing in the way that they want to do things um, about mike hessen like the exact words he was like you know mike hessen shadab said ke mike hessen se zyada calm insaan main kabhi nahi zindagi mein mila hu kisi se you know he is just literally the calmest guy and that made a huge difference to the team as up well. So you know it's one of the things it's it's crazy like the consistency of messaging and I think I mentioned it on the group that I had read this uh Fleming interview uh Fleming was talking to Monga um I had the IPL and he talked about you know like his role mainly and he's coach so it's different I guess slightly but you saying that the main thing that we've done at CSK which I want you to talk about actually is that you've created this environment which is very familiar for the guys who are already there and who are who have been part of the longer story but even for the guys who come in 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 a league system which is naturally transient ke log aate hain aur chale jaate hain you know ek mahina khelte hain fir chale jaate hain you still manage to create i think something more solid and more familiar for anyone who comes in they all know ki acha ye islamabad united ka environment hai yahan hum aise khelenge yahan hum aise karenge this is how we'll be held, held accountable or whatever and it goes from there like just talk a little bit about how you've done that over the years I think for me you know data is one thing and uh, you know uh, you know coaching side of things experts would know far better mike knows ke you know technique kaise hoti hai hanif malik works behind the scenes but for me the biggest achievement is the culture at islam by united personally for me it's huge because you know when we came into this field and we all amar was there with us as well so we all were used to cultures where you know uh, you were held, held accountable after one match and accountability is not on process accountability is on actual performance and that you know never made sense to me personally because you know to get that performance you have to follow a certain process to get to that performance ab pehle din se nahi keh sakte ki yaar tum perform nahi kar rahe and then you can ask players to be accountable once you give them that environment uh jahan pe wo ye complain na kar sakenge yaar you know i am not having fun i am bored uh, i am not taken care of take away every excuse that they might have and then you can hold them accountable as in you cannot say to them ke yaar um, you know for example agar aapka india pakistan ka match hai aur virat kohli ka bat aapke har player se better hai in terms of quality and aur fir aap keh rahe ho ki yaar ye 5 meter se zyada lambe chhakke kyu maar leta hai so you provide them with the same things and then you hold them accountable rather than ke there is a vast difference between your opposition and yourself so i think that was a building block here uh, personally for me dino also was a huge influence on this ke dino uh, ne pehle din se hi bola tha ke he was australian yes very harsh on a few things but he was also very certain of the fact that you build up your players you tell them that you are better than everyone else and uh, dino ki ye baat you know i I've, i've stuck by it to this day even wasim akram in his first uh, two seasons he did with islam united he was also uh, you know he also kept saying ke dressing room ke andar no matter if you win your win or lose your behavior should be the same uh, you should you know if you are laughing before the match you should be laughing at the end if you're angry before the match you should be angry at the end like your behavior should not go up and down depending on how the match goes and i think wo mera mere liye personally wo kafi learning experience tha uske baad personally you know shadab being the captain he also believes in the same thing ke you joke around 
कैप्टन फील्ड के ऊपर है वंस यू क्रॉस द बाउंड्री लाइन ही इज योर कैप्टन ऑफ दैट ही इज योर फ्रेंड ही समन यू जोक अराउंड विद ही इज नॉट समन यू कांट अप्रोच ही समन जिसके साथ शामिल भी वही बात कर सकता है जो कि नसीम शाह कर रहा है जिसके साथ इमाद भी वही मजाक कर सकता है जो कि हुनैन शाह कर रहा है तो आई मीन दैट दैट्स वन ऑफ द मेजर थिंग्स एंड इफ यू आस्क एनी प्लेयर मैं मुझे खुद खुद कुछ कहने की जरूरत नहीं है दिस इज वर्ड आई एम प्राउड ऑफ की यू आस्क एनी प्लेयर यू नो प्लेड एट इस्लाम बाई यूनाइटेड प्लेयर्स हु हर्ड अबाउट द कल्चर दे ऑल से दैट इट समथिंग दैट देव नॉट एक्सपीरियंस इन फ्रेंचाइज भी एंड इट्स समथिंग दैट दे वॉन्ट टू बी अ पार्ट ऑफ एंड इसकी बिगेस्ट एग्जाम्पल फॉर मी आई थिंक वो हमारी एक डॉक्यूमेंट्री भी आ रही है इमाद वसीम टॉक्स अबाउट इट तो आई लेट इमाद टू द टॉकिंग देयर के ही इज नेवर फेल्ट के एक ड्रेसिंग रूम के अंदर फ्रेंचाइज क्रिकेट के अंदर वो एसोसिएशन एंड देन सलमान अली आगा फॉर एग्जाम्पल के ही वॉज सो इमोशनल इन वन मैच एंड आई सेट आगा यू प्लेड इंटरनेशनल क्रिकेट यू प्लेड इन एशिया कप वर्ल्ड कप बट टूडे आई सॉ यू ही सेट बिकॉज इट फील्स लाइक दिस इज माई टीम इट फील्स लाइक you know the winning or losing is my responsibility it's my team when someone does not perform in my team i get angry and it's like you know instead of creating competition for the same place you create that harmony in the team ke yaar mera agar number 3 ka batter acha kar raha hai to number 5 ka kaam aasan hoga ye nahi hoga ki usko uske upar zyada pressure aayega and then you know you define roles and one of the things we just did differently this season is at the start of the tournament Mike Hassan and Shadab had a call with every single player a month before the tournament started and gave them their roles a month in advance ke ye tumhara role hai this is where we see you and this is what our expectations are of you and we will back you till the end aapka ye role hai aap apne role ke liye prepare ho ke aao so for example Haider ke sath jab Haider pick was a supplementary rounds ke andar Haider ke sath bahut clear discussion hui thi ke Haider don't prepare yourself to bat at number 3 don't prepare yourself to open prepare yourself to be a finisher and also keep in mind that there are no batting positions it's entry points and when the entry point is right you will go into bat and i mean the messaging was very clear in that regard ke it was said to every single player for example salman ali aga pehle din bataya tha ke think of yourself as an opener because if an early wicket falls you are the one who goes at number 3 if the wicket falls a bit later then shadab goes to counter so i mean that there was very clear messaging or kabhi bhi i think pure tournament mein There was no point जिसमें किसी भी एक बैटर के ऊपर कोई ओवर डिपेंडेंस हो लाइक वी वन मैच वेयर पीपल स्कोर थर्टीज वी वन मैच वेयर यू नो लाइक मुल्तान सुल्तान वाले चेस में एवरी वन टॉक अबाउट हम इस ये जो तुम बातें कर रहे हो वी गो थ्रू इच मैच एस पी एस एल में ताकि हमें समझ आए जहाँ तुम जीत रहे थे वहां से क्योंकि उस्मान और मैं पहले बट्टा फास्ट पे और फिर बिगेन पे टूर्नामेंट के रिव्यूज कर रहे थे तो हमारी अपनी भी राय थी जो यू नो सम ऑफ देम ऑब्वियसली यू न्यू एज़ वेल एंड 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 अ बिग पार्ट ऑफ इट कि क्योंकि हम बाहर से देख रहे हैं और हम हमें जो नजर आ रहा है जो आउटकम है उस पे जा रहा है तो तुम लोग प्रोसेस की बहुत ज्यादा बातें करते हो और ये सीजन 5 फॉर 1 खत्म 5 फॉर राइट लाइक वन वाज वॉशड आउट सो उसमें यू हैव एज मेनी डाउन्स एज हाईज आर्ग्यूएबली राइट तो आई थिंक दैट विल एक हमें भी मौका मिलता है क्योंकि और उसको शुरू करने से पहले थोड़ा सा मैं अपनी भी क्रेडेंशियल्स डाल दूं बिकॉज I feel PSL five. I was also working with you guys there, um, and it was as in my PSL me kam karata yello was me the, so I was there in that whole uh, entorno as Christ would put it. Um, or I'm look me. I think I can say this for for these guys for their team and everything because we were doing shoots with them. I was obviously meeting them every time in the same city. Okay, us vag bhi yehi bhashan jaar rahe the aur us vag the tapa ho rahe the yello. Everyone was injured. They were losing to everyone. मतलब ये था कि पहले एक दो matches में क्योंकि I feel this was the the first PSL and I'll cut this story short. I'm really sorry for waffling. But the first PSL में ना the first match that these guys played was the season opener. So the first PSL ever. और उस moment में मैंने realized क्या कि okay we're no longer just like even though we'd already done TV shows together. They went up another level क्योंकि हुआ ये था कि ये लोग हार रहे थे but it's like At that moment, it felt like a FIFA be game खेल रहा है रेहान और चीमा वो लोग हार रहे हैं. You know, so I took a picture that I tweeted and I was just like lol, ha ha ha, data or whatever. And when I ended the match and I opened it, and it was just like the PSL. In that moment, even though I was working in it, उसकी national level significance was really not clear to me. और अब अगर ये होता तो probably you know ये अखबारों में छप रहा होता कि yeah, the employee says this about फलाना डिमकाना ये वो तो in that moment i realized oh shit like inke upar kitna pressure hai aur kitni aankhein hai and everything and so in that like i can definitely testify to these guys holding on to that but let's go to the matches sabse pehla match 
um, you guys are playing your 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 nemesis basically um, at their home ground when they're two time defending champions and you guys beat them on a stroll and lahore ke khilaf unko kafi bura record bhi raha hai so in just like a few minutes talk to us about that game what you guys said before after how you were feeling i think sabse major cheez ye thi ke before going to the lahore match we were all very well aware of the decent track record we had against them yeah. and uh, there was this general so basically yani a lot of our team members myself included are good friends with a lot of players at lahore commanders like aur jab main pehle bhi keh chuka hu jab aap apne dost se haarte ho usse buri duniya mein koi cheez nahi hoti to you know haris roof also like wo aapko chhodta nahi agar aap haar jao to match se pehle bhi sari ye discussion thi and more than you know in in this match it was more emotional than process because it was like yaar inko is dafa harana hai like you know no matter what total they put up on the board we are good enough to chase it down and let's forget everything that's happened uh, jo hum do dafa 90 pe out hue hain those are things that don't happen every day they've happened to islam united twice in the last nine seasons so let's not read too much into that uh, and you know have a very clear identity of what we want to do and we went into that match thinking ke and we saw the pitch as where well. it was it was a really good pitch so we thought ke you know any anything between under 200 would be a very chaseable score on this pitch uh and you know what happened we we restricted them to around 190 194 and uh, yeah and then you know um jo mere mera favorite part hai ke there were so many doubts about saman ali aga coming into this tournament and the entire camp that we had before the season aga was the outstanding player at the camp that we did in islamabad on really bad pitches like the ball was seeming around and he still kept hitting shots and instead of looking at him as an anchor we suddenly started looking at him as someone who can do both things can anchor when needed and can also attack and then he worked a lot with hanif malik so uspe i remember when he wo jo do chakke usne mare the uh, uh, wo jo flick wale the immediately after the match he came to hanif malik and said thank you hanif bhai uh, main expect nahi kar raha tha ki match mein main try bhi karunga but wo basically muscle memory bani thi to maine maar diye he went with the flow and then sweetest part of it was um, shadab because he was so out of form um ilt 20 mus ki form nahi thi and before mm-hmm. the start of season i remember um uh, i said to someone ke islam bhai united agar ye tournament jeeti to shadab will be player of the tournament and usually it's like you know people think ke wo main bas keh deta hu ke shadab hai ya wo cuz i'm close to him and all but there was yeah. a general belief not just from me it was a belief from everyone in the team because they saw him in the camp they saw how hard he was trying to work and they saw how relaxed he was because mujhe ye doubt tha ki kahin wo khud under confident na ho but just, just to qualify this just to break this up for one second qualify this i think even before the world cup you had predicted that shadab was going to be player of the tournament <laughs> if pakistan if pakistan won so pakistan did not win <laughs> yeah so this same this same tha mera us waqt to i mean बिकॉज ही सो इम्पॉर्टेंट टू द बैलेंस ऑफ द टीम कि आपका एक बंदा टॉप फोर में बैटिंग करता हो आपके चार ओवर करके देता हो एक फील्डर हो तो यू दैट अलाउज यू टू प्ले एन एक्स्ट्रा बॉलर और एन एक्स्ट्रा बैटर इन यूर इलेवन एंड दैट बैलेंस दैट ही प्रोवाइड इज असेंशियल तो आई मीन वो उसकी जो इनिंग्स थी फिर उसका जो एंड द बॉलिंग स्पेल दी हैड लाइक टू फॉर आई थिंक सम लाइक ट्वेंटी फोर ही हैड इन दैट गेम एंड आई थिंक आठ दफा पी एस एल की हिस्ट्री में ऐसा हुआ कि किसी बंदे ने रन अप बॉल देके चार ओवर कम्प्लीट किए हुए हैं और सीमा ने 50 भी किया है एंड उन आठ में से चार दफा शादाब कर चुका हुआ है जिसमें से आई थिंक तीन दफा वो कलंदर्स के खिलाफ कर चुका हुआ सो आई मीन दैट्स वो उसकी ही रेजेस हिज गेम टू एन अदर लेवल व्हेन ही फील्स के ये राइवलरी क्रिएट हो गई है सो यू लुक एट हिज रिकॉर्ड व्हेन इस्लाम हैड दिस राइवलरी विद कराची किंग्स एंड शादाब ऑलवेज स्टेप्ड अप अगेंस्ट कराची किंग्स सिमिलरली जब से लाहौर से वो हुआ है तो ही फील्स दैट दिस इज द टीम टू बीट तो उसकी थोड़ी गेम उस पे रेज हो जाती है एंड आई थिंक दैट दैट चेस made us believe ke shadab is back in form and that would mean ke a lot of our problems are sorted so so that's just sorry, moving yeah. on from the shadab thing and like emer unless you have any other questions for this game i wanted to actually segue into the next game yeah and we discussed this emer and i discussed this this was the loss to multan i no sorry not multan yeah multan 144 pe out hue the multan mein and both emer and i were like Why should Shadab come in at? He came in at uh, three, six, seven. He came yeah. in at seven at that game. 
Um, and I know because Jordan Cox played, and actually Jordan Cox and, and Salman uh, Aga played pretty well in that. I think both 50 thi, Aga, yeah. Aga ki 50 thi, Jordan Cox ki 40 thi. But we wondered, and I, I think it must have been me because I'm an idiot that way. And I said that, look, it's really early in this tournament, but are they like, are they overthinking this? Like, why, why is Shadab, who is clearly the best player in that side, who's the leader of that side, pitchly game maybe you sent performance here, why is he coming as low as six? What, yeah, in what fact, we had an is? answer for it. And now you are talking all about this, obviously, we are listening to you often, right? So, we have not said that this socialist utopia is making Islamabad, all workers are equal, and Karl Marx is the best cricketer. So, in that case, the Shadab said, yes, I will submit my number four position to someone else. Like, you know, we were like, that's where it feels over-engineered, right? Ke, oh, we have to be so equal that we have to best player. Ko bhi niche and again, you are making these narratives because mm. that's our job, right? So, like, you don't necessarily have to, like, yeah, exactly. Why did that happen uh, I think, in the context of your process? I think one thing is right that, you know, both Shadam and myself are guilty of sometimes planning too far ahead. Uh, and... Usme ye hota hai ke, for example, Shadab strongly believes ke agar Fahim Ashraf aur Azam Khan form mein honge, to we will do well. And similarly, this season, mera ye belief tha ke agar Imad form mein hoga, to we will do well. Hmm. So, you try and give them as many opportunities, kyunki ab aapko pata chal gaya ke aga form mein hai, Shadab form mein hai, you need to bring in other people into form. And this is where Mike Hessen's role is very important because immediately after this game, he said to Shadab and myself ke, listen, you, when you're padded off, you think about your batting. Okay, you, you concentrate about your batting. Once you're out, you come out, then these discussions can be had. Um, and, you know, us match ke ye bhi tha ke, the pitch was very different. Um, agar spin pitch ho hoti, ball difficult hoti, to Shadab ka number 3 ya 4 bajana banta, because spin ho si ball ya break ka tha ball. It was seeming. Mm-hmm. And for seeming conditions, we thought ke Jordan Cox is the best possible option at that position at number 4. And, you know, uh, we batting order ki hum, you know it always shuffles at Islam by United everyone like Azam's batted at different positions throughout the season as well and I remember some conversation in our match that uh, this side ki boundary is so to should we send a lefty so I still remember saying that the other person who is batting is going to have a boundary size literally no problem which was Azam oh, the first ball I think first second ball he faces he hits uh, towards the longest side to Sama Mir which is like a crazy six and then he gets out but you know, sometimes we are guilty of that uh, as a team. We are guilty of that. Ke we do overthink, overanalyze sometimes. Ke you know, plan too far ahead, or you know, sometimes complicate things when they should not be. I remember idea. you. Um, was it you or somebody mentioned? And and you weren't with the Pakistan team at the time. But you remember the game that Pakistan Zimbabwe se hara tha, T20 World Cup in Australia. Mein. Yeah. Shadab was playing, and then he hit that shot, which came, I think, after like a couple of boundaries, at least in that over. Yeah. Yeah. Even though you weren't part of the team then. I yeah. think I remember this very clearly. You mentioned that this is clearly Shadab is thinking because he wants to keep the rate down. He is rate down, he is trying to When there yes. was no need for him to do that. But it was an example of Shadab overthinking things. I'm planning too far yeah. ahead. Yeah. And as a captain, as a, uska, uska hamesha, as a captain, hota hai ke, his first priority is always that, you know, Mary team may go south say art money form you heading into the playoffs and they are going to win us crucial games. That's always in his head. That's what how he thinks. So, you know, because he thinks so much, because he analyzes so many things. So, sometimes you have to, you know, tell him, ke, think about today, uh, think about what's going to happen today. It's very un Pakistan. So, do you know, it's a good way and then we can move on. Uh, and I'll ask the first one you answered and we'll do the second one uh, because I want to build that up a little bit. First question is that you are talking about your process and you are talking about it. In this match and in the next match, one thing was that when Islamabad was batting first and they were all right. And one thing was that when they didn't have a target for their haters, then they would then calibrate you know, calibrate नहीं कर पाते अपने कि मैं क्या करूँ innings किस तरीके से खेलूँ yeah. etc etc again it's very easy narrative to pick on because you guys batted first and were terrible in both yeah. these matches or you know कि वही कि why are they being terrible or 
ये क्या हो रहा है तो खैर तो तुमने हमें शादाब वाला बताया चीजिंग का क्या वट इज दर्नल फीलिंग इन साइड इस्लामाबाद एंड इज इट रेडी इतना बड़ा किलीज ही जैसे इन दो मैच इसमें नजर आ यार आई थिंक चेसिंग इज समथिंग दैट Just even before Shadab became captain, I don't think we ever batted first before that winning a toss. Misbah captain tha, J P Dhoni captain, Watson, um, Sami. I don't think we ever. Usse, balki Shadab is the one who's, jisne three dafa batting first ki decision liya. I think we won all three matches. Ek dafa usne Abu Dhabi mein against Lahore. Yeah, exactly. It comes yeah. happen to the playoffs as well. Yeah, Quetta ke against usne pichle saal ki thi. Isme Azam ne ninety odd kiya tha, and this season one seventy four against Quetta again. So I mean. इट्स नॉट लाइक हम ये बिलीव करते हैं कि टॉस के बाद अगर हमें पहले बैटिंग दे दो तो हम नहीं कर सकते इन फैक्ट तो मैदान वाला मैच था उसमें वही जो यू नो समिंग करने की इन वन ऑफ दीज मैच टू बैट फर्स्ट एंड टेस्ट आर सेल्स एंड आई वुड आर्ग्यू दैट दैट मैच अगेंस्ट मुल्तान गेव अस मोर कॉन्फिडेंस देन दी अदर गेम्स आई मीन इफ यू कैन पुश अ टीम लाइक मुल्तान हु आर बिल्ड टू चेस डाउन टारगेट ऑफ वन सिक्सटी Uh, at Multan, into the last over, with with your bowling attack, suddenly you start feeling so confident about your bowling attack as well. You suddenly you think that we can defend any total. And so, um, I, sorry, my second question yeah. is from the bowling attack. Because when 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 और जब सुबह हम शहरी पे थे तो मैंने पहली दफा देखा एंड एंड दैट वाज एक्चुअली वन ऑफ माय प्राउडेस्ट मोमेंट्स एज 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 अ पेस स्पेस यार फ्रेंड यू नो ऑल दिस फ्रेंड्स ऑफ माइन आर सो माशाल्लाह कंप्लीट राइट सो जो पीएसएल की प्रोडक्शन है उसमें टेडी काम कर रहा है जो पीएसएल जिस चैनल पे आ रहा है प्रांस टू है पीएसएल की जो टीम जो जीत रही है रेहान मैनेज कर रहा है बट ऑल्सो एट द हार्ट ऑफ इट यू नो देयर सर्टेन वैल्यूज एंड इंडिविजुअली शुएब एंड इमरान and i with each other had conversations purely on nothing to do with cricket on the scenes undeniable sex of you like i cannot <laughs> like he is at an insane level right now in person that anyone i've spoken to is feeling like it's it's crazy how hot he is uh wo jo usme wo kaun si movie hai ben siller ki modeling wali jo hai na to usme zulander yeah zulander he's like he's so hot right? like that's the level that nasim is at he was also coming from this devastating injury and but that you know ke bhai you have a player coming back from injury there's a billion things that are no longer the way it was it like nasim comes back as the dream nasim like like just he I mean, you know he's like what ai would create when you ask it to create nasim because usne har cheez wo kar di and in this match he's uh, he's really bowling well tumne ek baat mujhse ki thi ke nasim ko kabhi पहले नसीम से हमने डेथ ओवर भी कम करवाए लाइक वी वुड फिनिश इन दीन ओवर and you know people were being critical ki kyun kar rahe hain because death overs mein zyada zor lagta hai fast bowler ki thodi energy zyada lagti hai to we were trying to do that match by match aur jis match mein travel zyada hai us match mein thoda usko responsibility kam thi lekin the thing about nasim is ke you can bank on him even when he is not bowling at his best pace even when he is not swinging it like he does ke he will hit that length almost every mm-hmm. time wo ek natural I wouldn't even say वो वो एक natural gift है as in that's just unbelievable कि वो I mean warm up हो रहे होते हैं every bowler जब वो warm up कर रहा होता है तो you know bowler ball करता है वो कभी आगे जा रही है कभी पीछे जा रही है फिर वो fully warm up होता है वैसे ही you know casually warm up हो रहा होता है match से पहले वो warm up के अंदर भी he may may ball wide but length उसकी वही होती है जो and that's just just a gift that he has and you know when you see that in person I remember हमारे साथ we had some new people working with us in other team to kasim hamara media manager tha us so he was saying ke yaar i cannot believe and this is like in the tournament he said i cannot believe ke tv pe isko dekha tha i cannot believe that i'm a part of this guys team who is going to be a certified legend and is an absolute genius 
तो आई मीन वेन यू गेट लाइक दिस गाय इज नॉट बीन वर्किंग इन क्रिकेट फॉर अ वाइल बट नाउ ही इज इन द ड्रेसिंग रूम एंड ही सीज दिस गाय ऑल दो उसका काम यह है कि ही नीति टू स्टे स्ट्रिक्टली प्रोफेशनल प्लेयर्स के सामने ये नहीं शो करना लेकिन ही इज टॉकिंग लाइक द जनरल कंसेंस इज के नसीम ने ये टूर्नामेंट जो खेला है अमेजिंग टूर्नामेंट फिनिश एज वन ऑफ द टॉप फाइव मोस्ट इम्पैक्टफुल प्लेयर्स ऑफ द टूर्नामेंट गेट वी थिंक दैट ही स्टिल हैज मोर टू ऑफर दैट्स हाउ गुड ही इज एंड दैट्स हाउ मचोर ही इज एज वेल कि उसकी मेचोरिटी का लेवल बिकॉज मे बी बिकॉज ऑफ दो इंजरीज यू टॉक टू एम अबाउट क्रिकेट एंड इट्स इट्स जस्ट इन सेन के यू नो वो क्या सोच रहा है कितना आगे का सोच रहा है इट्स नेवर अबाउट दिस वन गेम इट्स नेवर अबाउट दिस वन बॉल there's always a plan there's a method behind what he's trying to do so i mean to see him in that especially that new ball spell that he bowled to riza hendricks and rizwan yeah. and Manu. you know hum log ek zamane mein kehte and i you know i'm not comparing but hum log ek zamane mein kehte the ki shaheen ka pehla over ek event hota tha that you can't i think bazid yeah. might have coined it the first time that it's an event you can't miss you know shaheen's first over but this especially this last 6 7 months i guess from the asia cup onwards मुझे लगा है कि दैट्स शिफ्टेड टू नसीम नाउ नसीम्स फर्स्ट टू ओवर्स यू यू गो थ्रू आउट द टाइम एशिया कप के बाद उसे इंजरी हुई ऑब्वियसली ही डिडंट बॉल बट थ्रू आउट दिस पीएसएल हिज फर्स्ट टू ओवर्स वर क्रेजी लाइक ही ही इज ही इज द वन बॉलर इन दिस टूर्नामेंट जिसके आगे अ साइम ऑर्डिनरी लगा है ही इज द वन वन बॉलर इन दिस टूर्नामेंट जिस पे यू नो साइम हैज बीन लाइक ओके आई एम नॉट श्योर व्हाट आई एम डूइंग हियर यू नो साइम की यूजुअली इतनी कॉन्फिडेंस है in a kind of arrogance that he has but i i don't i, th- I think it must have been that peshawar game which we can move on to eventually which which is not about the loss the crazy game arif yaqub wali game but yeah. usme i think the hell over the world was it that one it was right the usme next jo, one is the quetta one that they lost ha huh, we'll go to that yeah but the the first over that he bowled one of the overs to sign was just like it was crazy he was you know like it was like he was telling him ke ab dekho tum ab big boys league mein aaye ho baki mein abhi tumne yeah. bowlers Yeah, na. But it's now me. I'm Nasim Shah, and you're not going to get me away that easily. Acha, I'm going to speak an interesting thing. I'll tell you on the Nasim Shah event thing. Na, so Nasim Shah's most famous thing is that he doesn't pick up as many wickets, right? Mm. And when you see it firsthand, you realize why not? Because he's so good that edge to get on him, you have to be a very good batter. 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 It's not hmm. like people are leaving him alone, and it's not like they're just negotiating him. Like, वो खेल नहीं है, लग नहीं रही ball, inside edge में सो रही है, outside edge में सो रही है. तो, I mean, he's that good that sometimes, you know, if you're not as technically gifted a batter, you will not get an edge to him, and yeah. uh, that's just how good he is. So, अगला match तुम लोग फिर से आ रहे हो, फिर से batting पहले कर रहे थे. Uh, But they were put in. Had... They were put in by Quetta, I think. Yes. And yeah. also, okay, this was this was a very tight match. Uh, you know, wo, uh, several points lag raha tha ke jeet liyo. So, like, talk about like, ek is is match ke baare mein. Magar main dusri chiz jo ab tumne you alluded to it a few times. So I just want you to mix that into your answer. Ke, you know, ham soch rite hain shadab chahta hai ke saath bande form mein ho. Hamne socha ki ek match mein ham batting test karte hain. So, even though it's still a very short league, it's ten games. It's still enough. And then you got your playoffs. उसमें तुम लोग कितनी मार्जिन अपने दिमाग में रख रहे होते हो कि अच्छा यू नो इन लाइक इज इट कि यू नो लेट्स जस्ट गेट एट विंस और व्हाटएवर यू नो वी कांट लूज टू मेनी और ऐसे मतलब कि क्योंकि क्लियरली व्हेन यू ट्राइंग आउट दिस प्लान देन एक मकसद उनका यही है कि प्लेऑफ में आके हमें टर्न ऑन करना है सो यू नो जस्ट टॉक अबाउट दैट इन द कॉन्टेक्स्ट ऑफ दिस गेम वेयर यू पुट इन टू बैट एंड एंड क्वेटा बीट्स यू इवन दो तुम लोग काफी हद तक ऑन टॉप पे एक और विकेट लेते वहां पे और प्रॉब्ली जीत चुके होते या अगर वो डीआरएस वाले बाद में अपॉलॉजी ना देते तो ठीक है यार दिस दिस गेम गेम लाइक द एंड एंड सो होने की वजह ये भी थी कि जब रिप्ले आया है तो इफ यू सी बॉल का इम्पैक्ट और वो इट वॉज लाइक दो डिफरेंट बॉल्स दिखा आपको दो हार जाएंगे तो मस्टविन यू स्टिल नो के अगर यू नो मुल्तान इज अ टीम दैट यूर कम्पीटिंग विद फॉर द टॉप टू स्लॉट्स और जलमी ऑलरेडी लॉस्ट टू गेम्स एट द टाइम कराची यू नो आई थिंक एट वन वन लॉस्ट वन सो इट दे वॉज एन अ टीम अदर दैन मुल्तान हुई एट द टाइम 
एंड क्वेटा एट वन टू आउट ऑफ टू एंड वी न्यू के अगर यू नो हम इनको हरा देंगे तो वील गो अब दैम इफ यू लूज टू दैम वील स्टिल है बेटर नेट रन इट एंड वी गेट टू प्ले दम अगैन सो वी कैन कवर दीज टू पॉइंट बिकॉज यू नो इट इफ एसेंशली बिकम्स अ फोर पॉइंट सो आई मीन इट वॉज दिस प्रेशर के आर ये मस्ट वन मैच है बट आई मीन that that's that pitch was really tough to bat on uh, and mm. most teams saw that ke it was it was not like your typical lahore pitch lahore is not like a pindi pitch ke yahan pe aap you know 220 230 aim karte ho it's still 180 plus pitches most in lahore yeah. and that pitch was nothing like that and i think hamari isme you know foreign players ki bada crucial role hai ke they assess the pitch jab manro wagaira wapas aaye unhone kaha this is not a 180 pitch you know even if we get to 150 160 we are we are pretty much in the game mm. and we can defend this total and i feel ke eventually humne lakhri you know uh, death overs ko usna utilize nahi kiya and we ended up not getting above par because anything above 150 155 would have been above par we did not get there and when we started bowling yeah and especially like the choke that the spinners applied in the middle was very refreshing to see because you know we talked about naseem we talked about shadab having one really good game against lahore but the salman ali aga spell Imaz's contribution with the ball, Shadab applying the choke in that situation, it felt like it's an old school PSL match, which was in Dubai, where you know you can choke a team and get it up to eight and over, and in the last five overs even forty chase करना बहुत मुश्किल हुआ था. That it was that sort of a game, and uh, they were like, I remember that Bradley Russo was the one who was really everyone was really angry, um, and we ended up losing the game again. We took it down to the last over, and mm-hmm. again, despite not scoring a par total either two games where you took the opposition to the last over and both games you could have won had in one game a decision gone your way or an, in another a couple of catches had gone to hand so i mean it was that close and there was no panic in the dressing on a slight tangent on this game because is game ke baad mujhe yaad hai main aur rahmat bahut excited ho gaye the quetta ke bare mein we were like oh my god man quetta have the sexiest bowling attack how How was it watching Abrar bowl? Because he he's been like he's been very very good in the tournament, and you know he had the pitch to help him, but he was really good in that game, right? He was really really like as an opposition guy. What did you make of him? Yeah, the thing about Abrar that stands out, and Islam I read me bhi tha wo. Uh, the thing that stands out about Abrar is uh, yeah, I remember when he was first coming to PSL. Mein, so there was this one match he was playing for Zalmi and Manron has scored reverse pe shot mari hai wo so there's like logon ne ek narrative bana liya ki when you attack him he doesn't respond well hmm hmm but like the wo jo kehte na bravery wo agar kisi spinner mein is mulk mein hai to wo abrar mein hai he will get hit for a six wow. he will toss up the next one even more and like he knows how to pick up wickets like he's actually always looking for wickets like He's not trying to contain you. His head is in mm-hmm. the wicket, 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 wicket. He's very different to the sort of spinners we have going around, uh, especially mm-hmm. modern day spinners. Like even if you talk about the great spinners or all around the world, not just PSL, so in his head, it's you contain, then you get a wicket. His thing is you get a wicket, and that's how you contain. And he's always searching for that, and that's some. That's why sometimes he goes for sixes in his last over. That you take his PSL and take a look. Okay, he's trying to buy that wicket, and that's something that he will learn over time. Okay. you know if you bowl really good first three overs you don't need to buy a wicket in your fourth over it will come itself that's something you will learn but honestly uska skill level ka sabko pata hai but mentally jo uska belief as self belief he doesn't rate any batter against him he thinks like he's proper wo jo pipi mentality hai na ki usko lagta hai ki main kisi ko bhi out kar sakta hu and it doesn't matter who it is ke tkc who is one of the best players of spin jo rashid khan ko chakke maarta hai uh-huh. agar aap usko out karke ye kar rahe ho to i mean And despite knowing कि वो आपका अगला मैच उसके साथ रावल पिंडी में है दैट रिक्वायर्स अ स्पेशल काइंड ऑफ ब्रेवरी एंड आई थिंक ही ही हैज दैट सो वाचिंग हिम वाज वाज स्पेशल एंड ऑलवेज इज बिकॉज ही ही इज डिफरेंट इज एज अ पर्सन आई थिंक इफ अ क्रिकेटर कैन ट्रांसलेट व्हाट ही इज एज अ पर्सन ऑन द फील्ड दैट्स द बेस्ट पॉसिबल वे यू डोंट प्रिटेंड टू बी समवन एल्स एंड अबरार डज नॉट प्रिटेंड टू बी एनीथिंग अदर देन व्हाट अबरार इज व्हिच इज a very very confident man which that's, is that's, which is the opposition spinner is the perfect segue to the next game <laughs> which was the zalbi game acha ek uh, second just uh, just one thing there one okay. thing on the processing so it's like you yeah, the multan game uh, multan hit one of the last two balls and we have shadab assembles this field where nasim is standing right next to the stumps and 
Obed is, you know, on the square leg boundary because, you know, if it's a bouncer, it top edge, whatever, right? Mm. So, before that ball is bowled, Shadab goes to Naseem and says, doesn't matter if you win or lose the game. When we feel the ball, you come to the stumps because you have to get the batter out. And Shadab says to Naseem, okay, you eat a chakka, anything will happen. He, Naseem wasn't bowling, he was fielding. Like, I will never say anything about the performance. But these things, these little things in our hands, you are standing here. He said, done. Ball went. Uh, I think he went to point, he went point the throw. Now Naseem doesn't go to the stumps. He didn't go to the throw. He didn't go to the throw. He didn't go to the throw. He didn't go to the other end. And Shadab shouts at Naseem. And Naseem is laughing. And after that, in the dressing room, like, they both are great friends and everything. And Naseem was apologetic. So he said, yeah, we're going to match. So Shadab said, look, there will be one match in which we have to defend the last ball and you have to stand here. So you need to be prepared for it. That's how he thinks. And now why Naseem's laughing is something else. So you know how, you know, when you cross, the match is finished there. The overthrow of run doesn't count. You know. Uh-huh. So Batman, batters cross crossed the ball. And the throw came. And Ubaid Shah has stopped full length dive and the overthrow of the ball. So Naseem went to him and said, what are you doing? उसने कहा यार मैं नेट रन रेट का शो सोच रहा था कि अमेजिंग बात अमेजिंग रोड बट सो ऑपोजिशन स्पिरिट्स का नेक्स्ट गेम इज द जलमी गेम एंड दिस आई थिंक इज वेयर हमने इस वक्त करी थी अपनी केट मिडल्टन वाली एनालॉजी नहीं काफी बात आगे जाके की थी बट दिस इज ये इस पॉइंट पे ना कि जहां आपका ईमान असली में टेस्ट होता है राइट लाइक आप आप तीसरा लगातार मैच हारते हो आप क्या कहते हैं ना ही सिर्फ ऐसे हारते हो आप हार रहे हो एक बिल्कुल बौखलाए तरीके वे में अगेंस्ट दिस अंकल जो यू नो तीन संडे पहले एक और व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप है जिसके बहुत सारे बैंकर्स वगैरह होते हैं उन अंकलों के खिलाफ वो बॉलिंग करा ठीक है उसने आके आपको ऐसा तबाह बर्बाद किया एंड टू जस्ट एड नदर लेयर टू दिस and i just want you to very quickly just you could talk about because of no season ho gaya art season ho gaya thi badi baat nahi but also against the superstar captain of pakistan who you guys had dropped after the first season of the bsa like is it a grudge match with babar still does he view it as one and and you know talk about this game yeah yeah i think firstly i'll answer the babar question uh ek to mujhe bahut ummeed thi ki jab wo karachi kings se peshawar zalmi chala gaya to humse puchna log chhod denge kyun jaane diya karachi kings wala se puchhenge lekin नौ साल बाद भी वही सवाल आ रहा है आई थिंक देर इज नो लाइक आई एल जेनवनली जेनवनली से दिस एंड आई इवन से दिस यू नो ऑन द रिकॉर्ड ऑफ द रिकॉर्ड देर इज जेनवल जेनवन रिस्पेक्ट टूवर्ड्स बाबर फ्रॉम इस्लामा यूनाइटेड एंड फ्रॉम बाबर टूवर्ड्स अ टीम एंड ओवर द इयर्स इट इट हैज क्रोन इवन मोर स्पेशली दिस सीजन इट फेल लाइक लाइक आई मेट हिम इट फेल लाइक ही इज अ मोस्ट रिलैक्सड आई सीन इन द लॉन्गेस्ट टाइम ही इज एंजॉइंग हिज बैटिंग एंड फॉर मी पर्सनली इन टर्म्स ऑफ इम्पैक्ट दिस वॉज इज बेस्ट पी एस एल सीजन यट It was just unbelievable this season, uh, and especially that innings. Yani, usne koi, I think he scored forty runs of his last nine or eleven balls against us, hmm. and none of them was a shot. Just me, you can say, usne koshish bhi kiyo. Like he shuffles on one side, the baller does the right thing, which is bowl wide, and he still hits it for a four. Or bad balls length outside off stump, he shuffles, plays the ramp. You don't see Baba play the ramp, but. That's the good thing. That this season he tried new things and it, they came off. And on difficult pitches, like if his yeah, strike rate was last season, then so last season the pitches were better. This season he played on really tough pitches and he still maintained a really high strike rate, a high impact. And I mean, that game is one of like as an opposition. You when you were watching, so we had one point that you know power hitting for we have to stop Ali and Rahman Powell. And then suddenly you see the scoreboard, and this guy is like played ten, eleven balls and scored forty of the last ten, eleven balls he faces, and it's just unbelievable. And you know sometimes he does this to you, that you realize not that he has hit you so many times. When you see the scorecard, you see what happened. Yeah, Bawar is the world's most renowned batters. On the other hand, Arif Yaqub, you probably didn't even have a lot of data on him. Maybe you did. You know what? what... We, we did. We did have sufficient, sufficient not data but sufficient video clips of him. Video clips. Uh, yeah. And we we were like the thing that stood out about him was that even if he tries to bowl fast, he his pace is highest pace would be something around eighty five. He bowls really slowly. So let's hope the pitch is not low because if the pitch is low, then at that pace it's difficult. Pitch थोड़ी low थी. 
इवन आजम ने जो उसको छक्के मारे थे वो बाउंड्री बेरली बाउंड्री पार किए थे अदर देन दैट तो आजम छक्के मारता तो बेसिकली उसकी मिस हिट भी गोस फॉर 90 मीटर्स सो यू नो दैट वाज देयर देन आई थिंक वी वर डाउन एंड आउट इन दैट मैच बाय द 10th ओवर चेसिंग दैट एंड देन इट्स वन ऑफ द मोस्ट रिमार्केबल इनिंग्स आई हैव सीन ऑन अ क्रिकेट फील्ड वाचिंग आजम डू व्हाट ही डिड या लाइक इट्स जस्ट अमेजिंग एंड यू नो वी वर एट वन पॉइंट वी थॉट कि यार नेट रन रेट मैं जनरली ड्रेसिंग हूं मैं मैंने सेम में सोचा यार नेट रन रेट यू नो बिकॉज़ खराब नहीं होना चाहिए and suddenly you were like oh we're going to win this and then azam got out right and then that over comes in 21 and manro was not in good form i think he scratched his way to a 70 odd in that innings yeah. and i think that innings basically changed his tournament as well because he once you spend that amount of time on the crease you realize when manro got out, got out so suddenly you require 11 of 21 right so the new batter coming in uh what what does he do he try to to take a single tries to go for a two and the ball is a little short and heather plays that pull which on another day could have gone for six and we would have thought oh you know wow, wow what a shot we won and all we went straight to the fielder then you know credit to arif yakub he slowed it up even more against the two lefties which is imad mm-hmm. and uh, fahim who both are really good hitters of pace but against spin i think credit goes to him ki usne kitni slow bowling phenki hai okay aap 19th over karwa rahe ho and you're not afraid to give it flight and yeah, with brave bowling yeah and that, that's that's i think there we gave credit to him after the match we discussed it in the dressing room as well kr collapse hua do we think too much about this do we let it go um and personally mujhe lag raha tha i was quite disappointed after that game pehle jo pichli do defeats thi uske upar main disappointed nahi tha cuz i knew we had enough in the team to get back from them this was a little little you know damaging in terms of fact ke last season we lost a match which we should have won against peshawar zalmi in the knockouts mm. and this season a match that we should have won the last two overs we lost and uh, so wo thodi si cheez thi and this is like that speech that imad gives in the dressing room where the bag is placed there are two stars on top of it and he says ke you know with the third star will be here we need to keep believing in ourselves the same messaging goes from shadab the same messaging goes from mike hassan i contribute in my own way and the messaging is very clear okay do not panic do not you know read too much into it and i, I remember uh, is pay mike hassan said ke if you keep thinking about your failures you know you're almost you know predicting it will happen again so get over it move past it and you know be a little calm be a little more clever instead of hitting sixes towards a longer boundary you could have taken twos it's not you know i'm not being critical of you guys but i'm just telling you that take the option which is the most logical one hasan ka tum zikr kar rahe ho and i know agar kuch hoga bhi obviously you work with him and i'm going to throw him under the bus but in terms of what you can share is point pe obviously you know he's seen a lot of cricket so i wouldn't expect him to start getting frustrated but this is iska pakistani cricket ke sath pehla tajurba tha to usme usne koi you know at this low point was anything that he noticed that was different and so i'm not just talking about like oh ye bade chuti hain ye sorry <laughs> but yeah. you but um k you know like something that was different about how they were approaching things or whatever or any such thing that like you know did it and any of it change his demeanor yeah i think i can say this on the record of the record very openly literally us match ke baad shadab shocked tha ke you know कोच ने कोई ओवर रिएक्ट नहीं किया एंड ही एक्चुअली आस्ट मी सेड कि यार इतना काम है यार जब हम बैटिंग करते थे तो ड्रेसिंग रूम में इसने कुछ बोला नहीं जब हम फील्डिंग करते कुछ बोला नहीं आई सेड नो यू वाज वेरी काम एंड शदाज लाइक रियली इज लाइक या एंड देन यू नो दैट ऑब्वियसली इफेक्ट्स एवरी प्लेयर बिकॉज़ प्लेयर्स जब फेलियर आता है ना तो आप सबसे पहले देखते हो कि आपका कप्तान आपका कोच उनके क्या रिएक्शन रहे बिकॉज़ बेसिकली आप वैलिड यू आर सीकिंग वैलिडेशन और यू आर थिंकिंग कि आई नीड टू हाइड इन अ कॉर्नर and you know for imad who was not performing that well at that time to come out and give that speech was huge because wo that ball that he gets out to is a ball in the slot and uske baad bhi usne bola tha ki ye shot to mere se miss nahi hoti and similar shot pe usne chhakka mara tha multan sultans ko baad mein tournament ke same ball which was reversing even more than that ball that he got out to and it's like you know this these things happen isse bura kuch nahi ho sakta and that us match mein ye general sentiment us match ke baad ये था कि टीम का के नथिंग कैन बी वर्स देन दिस वी हिट 
rock bottom in 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 terms of what we are as a team and isse bura nahi ho sakta to it's all up now and everything will be fine um, okay yeah bahar se it was like man this is they suck <laughs> but, yeah but uh,